Okay, what we're showing here is a demo of what Science Clue is like. Two students come into a room, they'll sit at a chair, back to back, and they're going to get four minutes to try to identify as quickly as possible um, up to 40 words. And so what I'm going to do is show, uh, this is Andrew, I'll show Andrew the first uh, word. As soon as I show him the first word, the time will start, and he'll give a clue, give a one or two word clue, and then um, this is Grant, say hi Grant. Hey. And then Grant will try to make a guess. Now he has to say something, a word, something, for Andrew to give another one or two word clue. He can't use proper nouns. He can't say any part of the word. And so what I'm going to do is try to demonstrate quickly, uh, through a few words, exactly how this will go at a competition. Are y'all ready? Yes. Here we go. Electricity. Current. Um, iron. Magnet. Planet. Earth. Largest. Jupiter. Rings. Saturn. Finger shapes. He said finger. Have to pass that term. The word was fingerprint. Uh, lamp. Light. Glowing. Fluorescent. 70s. Lava. Dinosaur dead. Fossil. Opposite prey. Predator. Build muscle. Protein. Not asteroid. Comet. Airplane pusher. Lift. Engine stick. Pass. Good. So you can see there, he could say pass. I'll put that over here. That would go on for four minutes. You also notice that one of the words is fingerprint, and he said something with the word finger in it. That was an automatic pass as well. You want to try to get as many correct words as possible, which go in the correct pile. If you make a mistake, or you can pass it any time if you're not getting the word um, fast enough and you want to continue to try to get another word. Or you see a word you just know you're never going to get, you could say pass. So basically the game is get as many correct as you can, as few as pass as you can in four minutes.